Barbara Chase never thought of using a gun until now. Fear is her motivation. Fear of the person who the authorities believe killed two people in her Monrovia neighborhood and up to five more in the San Gabriel Valley. It's either that or be a sitting duck. I have grandchildren. They come to stay. Should I sit by and watch them get killed or should I try to save them? Do you like the idea of having to learn how to use a gun? No. I find it appalling. I find it heartbreaking. I find it all those things. Chase isn't alone. Enrollment at the Santa Anita firing range is up 150 percent. For the first time, 35 percent of the students are female, and most are here because of the killer. The Santa Anita firing range isn't the only place people are turning to for help. In neighboring Arcadia, for example, the police department has stepped up its efforts for the first time in years. We have hired uh, several additional officers on an overtime basis and uh, put them on the street during the primary of the hours of darkness. The lieutenant says the daily calls have doubled from frightened residents who aren't sure what to do. The police tell them to make sure they secure their windows and doors with proper locks. That helps explain why sales of special locks and security systems are up at this Los Feliz hardware store. Nancy Gilmore is buying a lock to secure her windows. Well, I'd heard a lot about these burglars that have been happening, and also it's kind of hard in the summer. You know, it gets hot in the apartment, and you want to leave your window a little bit open, but also not have anybody be able to get in. The authorities believe that one man who looks like this is responsible for at least 14 recent attacks, including seven murders. They say the same man might be responsible for as many as 30 such incidents. Elizabeth Anderson, Channel 4 News in the San Gabriel Valley.